Hello everybody. I have some Graphic 45 cards that I wanted to share. I made them using the Secret Garden collection. I used the 8x8 pad and some of the 12x12 and then the chipboard pieces. And it was a lot of fun. Um, I've got a craft fair coming up. And I wanted to have a bunch of cards made, especially because Mother's Day is coming up. So my craft fair is the day before Mother's Day. And I made some a bunch of shabby, chic, um, kind of vintage style cards with that paper. So I wanted to share them with you. My mother-in-law also helped me with these. And we just love working with Graphic 45. So... <clears throat> Here they are. Here's the first one. I used the Recollections cream cards from Michaels and inked all the edges with tea dye and all the paper we inked also. So this one I used this chipboard piece here with some pink tulle and I cut this into a banner and layered all the beautiful paper and they have, the paper has this, these pages with all these like looks like seed packets almost but they're all these cutouts so we really utilize those and then there's the inside and we um, I have this kind of distressed uh, cream colored thick cardstock that I use to put in the center here so that people can write their sentiment or whatever you know write their uh, message on the inside and we inked it up also so there's the inside of that one this one's a little more simple I love this paper though. It's got the sage green with the bird cages everywhere and the keys. And then I um, used this beautiful green down here with the border and strung some lace through this chipboard piece that coordinates. And there's the inside. I love this sticker. And I had the sticker sheet too, so I used the stickers. I used one sticker on each on the inside of each of the cards for the embellishment in the corner. Next one is this one, and we layered the papers and used this big chipboard piece here. I just think it looks so good when you ink the edges and <clears throat> really use all the what the um, collection offers. So there's the inside of that one. We made ten of these um, Secret Garden collection out of the Secret Garden collection, so. Here's this one, and I love this yellow paper so much. And this came out of the 8x8 um, pad as well, and we cut this out and inked it and just layered and did like a um, border here. And this chipboard button came with the collection as well. And there's the inside. And we just matched the little daisy sticker with the front. Here's another one, and I really like how this one came out because we used some vintage lace over here and I really like that idea. So there's this and this is so pretty. Plant good seeds and we did the lily of the valley. There's the inside of that one. Um, here's another one I really like how we use the lace. We did a vertical card for this one and I love this image so much and then we used the cute chipboard piece and we did some lace that I got from I think Hancock Fabrics. I picked it up and we just glued it down there and there's the inside and on some of these vertical ones, well most of them there's this big page of cutouts in the collection um, I think we used the 12 by 12 for this one but there's like a page full of these cutouts and it's perfect for um, the person to write their message in here on the inside so we really utilize that a lot throughout the um, cards that we made here's this one, I think this one was my mother-in-law's favorite we used like the lavender paper and I strung seam binding that I ordered from Shabby Beautiful on Zibit. Um, I strung some of that through this chipboard piece and we did layer, layer, layer upon layer. I love it. It's another vertical card. So there's the inside. It's really cute. And then this one I did more seam binding. So pretty did the um, like the lilac or la lavender and the cream color. And we did a bunch of layers of papers back here with the big beautiful chipboard piece. And there's the inside. This one's my favorite. Um, another vertical one. And I love the I love the chipboard and this 
um, cut out. I just love it. It says, spring is the sun shining on the rain and the rain falling on the sunshine. It's so, such a cute um, design and a really pretty quote. And here's the inside of this one. I love that with the postage stamp. Really vintage. So there's that one. And then the last one is this vertical one. And I like, again, I love this paper. And we use this kind of sage green strong tool through the chipboard. And we glued down friendship right there. And then here's the inside. So these were so much fun. And I'm going to package them up for my craft fair next Saturday and I will be back to show you some October afternoon cards. Thanks for watching. Bye.